right now that we're in order, let's rise for the Pledge of Allegiance, please. Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, we can't amend the agenda because this is a special meeting, but could I have a, a motion to approve the agenda? I'm a, this is Sean. I'll make a motion to approve the agenda. Thanks, Sean. All in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 Okay, motion carries unanimously. We have two items on here. Uh, first one, you should have a draft of our proposed meeting schedule for 2021. It is the basically the same procedure we're following this year, second Monday of every month, unless that's a holiday, which I think happens once and then falls to a Tuesday. All right, can I have a motion to approve the proposed schedule? This is Kate. I'll make a motion to approve the 2021 meeting schedule. All right, motion has been made. Any discussion? Seeing none, all in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 All right, motion carries unanimously. And then the last item is the installation and service agreement from Connecticut Water. <clears throat> this is basically so they will operate the water supply that's being installed in the Tylerville area. This contract reads a little bit strangely simply because it really should have been signed before construction actually began. Yeah. So there's, a, all, all, there's some expenses listed on here in Chapter 5, or excuse me, Paragraph 5, including $425,000, I believe it is, to town to pay Connecticut water. That money's already been paid. That was all paid for out of the grant. Basically, point forward, even though the system remains ours in name, for all intents and purposes, it's Connecticut Waters. They'll, maintain, they'll operate it. They'll maintain it. There's no cost to the town, except that we do have to pay for the fire hydrants, and that would be true if Connecticut Water owned the system. We'd be paying for fire hydrants. It's a pure approved rate, and that's 3000 a month for the fire hydrants that were put in. But as far as the system operation, maintenance, repair, that's none of our problems at all falls to Connecticut Water. This contract has a six year duration, renews automatically unless either party decides to withdraw and it talks about the procedures for that in here. I mean, originally Connecticut Water was looking for a 60 year contract because that covers the whole depreciation on the system. Uh, Frankly, I'm sorry, I'm just not willing to commit to something that long, although why not? It wouldn't be my problem, but um, <laughs> we agree no, on this. Probably not Kate's. Right, it comes after me, after us, so we're good. But uh, so anyway, we've settled on this six year initial and five year repeating terms after. All right, any questions or concerns on the contract? I think Kate's uh, questions, I think, hit all the points that I've, the, after I, I finally got a chance to read the whole thing, hit my questions also. You know, um, Kate, I think you brought up a good one. If it, this expires and they decide not to renew, who becomes the general contractors to, to repair and maintain? It falls to us either to do it under the Water Pollution Control Authority or to find someone else who agrees to operate it. I mean, and this was part of the sticking point on this. I mean, the, I think the original intent on the town's part is that after the system was installed, we would turn it, we would give it basically to Connecticut Water to own as well as operate. That brought some tax implications to them. They didn't want to receive it because, according to a recent tax ruling, they'd it'd be a it'd be income to them. They'd have to pay on it. So they weren't going to accept it. So the best we could come up with is they would they would operate it. We'd own it. But to that to that question, if for some reason they decide they don't want to keep operating it, or if for some reason we decide we don't want them to, that system maintenance and repair and everything else falls to us, unless we find another contractor to take it over. 
And I don't know if uh, we have a wonderful public works department, but I'm not sure they have the expertise or training to maintain a water system. So we would have to contract wow. it out anyway. Right, either that or start our own department on, you know, hire people with the appropriate expertise. Yeah. I mean, I don't envision that happening. I don't see why Connecticut Water would want to pull out of it unless the company goes bankrupt. But you're right. If it happens, we've got to figure out how to make this thing run. And this is Kate. So, um, so the businesses and the individuals that are hooked up to it into it right now, do they they pay like a, yes. a hookup fee? And then I'm assuming there's annual fees, but that's all coordinated through Connect, like Connecticut Water bills them directly. So there's like the town's really not responsible for billing people and collecting money related to the system. Yeah, yeah, that's correct. Like I said, if this okay. is it. Connecticut Water actually did own the system, except they're not. We're going to maintain ownership of the pipes. They're going to do everything else. Okay. I'm good with it. Okay. Yep. I nothing further. All right. Can I have a motion to approve uh, or to give me authority to sign this contract on behalf of the town? This is Kate. I'll make a motion um, to grant for Selectman McGarry um, authorization to sign the installation and service agreement. Okay, motion is on the floor. Any further discussion? No. Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor, say aye. 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 Motion carries unanimously. And with that, we are done with our meeting. Can I have a motion to adjourn? This is Sean. I'll make a motion to adjourn. All right. All in favor? Aye. 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 All right, everyone. Thank right, have you a wonderful day. Done. Stay happy safe. Have a happy new year. Happy don't new lock year. yourself in your bathroom. If you do, don't call 911. Figure it out right. some of the way. <laughs>